Okay, we've come across this today, and it's in the, uh, doesn't matter which toilet it's in anyway. Uh, what's happened is we've took the ball valve off by taking the split pin out from there. Took the ball valve off. We cannot drain this system for the simple reason is, if I just hold that, I think the diaphragm's bust inside, so we've got to change this whole unit here. So what Jack has done ingeniously, <laughs> Ta -da. <laughs> Ta -da. Cut a pot. <laughs> so we're going to start drain the system out, and we'll show you how we replace the whole unit, the system. That's good, just okay. Juggy did the system. <laughs> the system is now totally dry by just finishing off. <laughs> so now what we're going to do is just get your hand underneath, <laughs> and underneath should be a screw. So we're going to undo a big thread and take the whole system out. <laughs> Yes, just in case we forgot to mention, make sure you turn the water off. All you're looking for, you, you wouldn't be able to drain the system anyway, so it's common sense. Turn the water off, please, and then start removing. We're just going to get a pair of mole grips for the big... Not, not there. And then we'll undo that, and then the other one's come off, so this tube is now free, and then we'll replace the system. Okay, what Jack is doing now is refitting the downspout. That'll turn up when we turn to it. Right, and bit. He's going to put a little bit of multi-use, multi-use solvent adhesive. Don't get adhesive to put round the bottom of the <laughs> <laughs> so we can make a nice seal. I'll give him a hand doing that, and then we'll put we put a new rubber seal on that pipe. You see the black seal. There was no rubber seal on that. So we've just replaced that, and there's a nut. And the, well, the wash is that big one that I go on first, Jack. Um, oh, see, damn it! Here we go. <laughs> so we'll put that back on first, and make sure you do that. So pull the pipe out. Flip. That's it. That's fine. That's it, yeah. It. Okay. Put the pipe back in. We'll fit it in the back of the toilet. Yep. All good. Go back in the system. Do you hold that for me? I'll hold that and give me a second. Okay. We have just. <laughs> See, sealed this and this straight around my finger. We, we, and then this <laughs> is now going to be inserted over the top of the downpipe and then into the system. Look, it's like a glove. And then Jack is going to get on his hands and knees, which he does quite regularly. Oh, my sore knees! And pull the first one up. Which you will then tighten with a pair of huge humongous mole grips. Remember the, the trick to this is having good wrist muscles. Good wrist action. Makes a firm connection. Yeah, firm connection, everybody's happy. <laughs> <laughs> right, shall I push down on the top unit, hold it while you Excuse me? Shall I put down push down pressure on the top unit while Jack uses his mole grips? <laughs> which is what he calls his <laughs> <laughs> to tighten up the system. That would be tight. wonderful if you could push down top of you for me. I'm just going to stop. So we just put a little bit of pressure. Tighten the uh, main nut and washer up. Main one. <laughs> <laughs> nut up and it's squeezed the nice bit of um, sealant around the edges. And Jack's just moving it again so I'm just going to put that back into place. Sorry mate. That's okay. Okay, good. Whew. Just turn that around a bit more. Okay. Bit of pressure on that. Do you know what I mean? If you can put that back here. There you go. That's it. So we just lined it up with a bit of pressure putting it one way. Right. Then we'll have to link that up, which is the, the pull. Okay. Jack uses brute force and ignorance because he would like that. <laughs> Beautiful, see? You animal. <laughs> and then what he'll do then, he'll refit the ball cock. Cock and ball. Some people like to call it. Using the split pin provided. Can't find the old mate. <laughs> <laughs> Keeps me out of trouble, actually. I'm having trouble finally getting the old. Come on! Oh, oh. Go off in! Ah, it's always a thicker half that struggles to get in there. Yeah, yeah. Always my trouble with thicker half. And Jack's pretty thick. <laughs> <laughs> so your mum says. 
I'm going to use a screwdriver and put pressure Actually, on that one. Actually, that's a good idea. <laughs> Where is it? Is it. Okay, so put a screwdriver in the end of the split pin. I can see that because Jack can't see. I've got the phone in the way. By the way, this is the new Samsung S7. Which he's always talking about, because he loves it. Yeah. I can't get there, you know, mate. You never do? Yeah, you have a go. I'll hold this. Yeah, you hold this. I'll never mooch around, I'll, I'll wiggle around you. No, it wasn't even recording, mate. That's just recorded. No, it's not recording now. So, he's putting the split pin back in. We've had to straighten it, because Mark tends to bend things. Because he's super strong, of course. Oh, of course. Get a zoom up of that action. Oh, blimey. Go on, look at that. Whee. Get around that way. Whee. Oh, split pin action. Never wiggle. Beautiful. Right, back out. Go for it. Nope, it's not going. Should we use half of it? There we oh. go. There we go. There we go. You got it. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> it's thinking about it. Oh, you shit. Oh, sorry, it's swearing. And we're in. And we're in. Okay. Beautiful. Launch. Okay. Jack's having the pleasure of switching the water on because if it leaks everywhere, he's got to clean it up. No, nope, all dry. Okay, let's get some pressure in it and fill it to the top. And make sure the stop clock is in the right place. And the ball, because if you don't mind the ball up, it catches. Yeah. It won't push the water off. Any leaks, Jack? Let's check it. No, mate. Let's go for a flush, baby. Let's go for a flush. <laughs> oh, come on. There we go. That wasn't a big flush, was it? No, it's just wee wee. Put it down a bit harder. Oh, wait for it, wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, ready? Ready? Yep, full flush. Oh, this one we have to adjust now on the side. 